So the day you guys are seeing this is January 10th, 2023, which is the day that Windows 8.1 officially ends support. For this video, I decided to install Windows 8.1 on a VHDX on my main to be able to install it and show it running on modern hardware, as well as getting the last update that it received. Because I wanted to do this since 8.1 does have a special place in my heart because I got a laptop with Windows 8 back in beginning of 2013. I remember updating it to 8.1 even. But later on, I had issues with that laptop and I ended up selling it, which I'm pretty sure a lot of the issues was the hard drive and also the fact that I got a faulty update back then, which made it crash at startup. It wasn't the laptop at all. It was just a bug that happened. But you guys can see I'm installing Windows 8.1 on modern hardware because this is on my main system. I did a VHDX because it's really easy and I can easily delete it afterwards. And I wanted to see how 8.1 ran on my hardware, which surprisingly it actually ran well, and I was impressed. You guys will see a later clip of me trying it on my Surface, which you'll see how that went, but I tried it on both my desktop and my Surface, and it seems that my desktop runs it the best because, uh, let's just say my Surface didn't get very far when trying to do this, so... You guys will just watch me installing 8.1, sorry the video might be kind of fast, but... I just quickly, you know, ran through setup and stuff like that. I think I forgot to uncheck something, but it doesn't matter. It's not like I'm keeping the install anyway. But after I get this set up and stuff, you guys will see me installing the last Windows 8.1 update. Well, obviously first you'll see my Surface, but then you'll see the last Windows 8.1 update. So you guys can enjoy watching this and enjoy me getting the drivers. I did do the GPU driver off camera though because it wasn't wanting to work through device manager so I had to do it a different method. So yeah. 